Hello, inner tubers, and happy Thanksgiving. Here we are, just two and a half weeks past the most fucked up election this country has ever seen. You know, I'm not having any family coming this year, so I invited a bunch of friends, and I thought that my most pressing problem would be figuring out a seating chart. You know, I would have a blue table for doing emails and losing them, and I would have a red table for grabbing pussy, and I would have a fucking table out on the patio for all the independents, because you know they can solve every fucking problem we have. But you know what? That is not my biggest issue. So as I was getting ready to have everybody come for dinner, the RSVPs started coming in. First, I got some emails. One person said, oh, I'm on a very tight schedule that day because I'm going to see my grandmother in the morning and I'm going to see my ex's family in the evening so I could come if you're having dinner in the middle of the afternoon. What the fuck? You're going to eat three meals? That's just being greedy. Then I had another one from someone who said, I have to work all day and I probably can't make it on time for dinner, but I would love it if you would save me a plate of leftovers. Leftovers. Sure. Yeah, I can do that, of course. I had another one that said, oh, I'm on a low sodium diet, so I'll be sure to ask you about every dish on the table. Make sure I don't exceed my daily sodium capacity. If you don't want to come to dinner and you don't want to eat what I'm serving, then eat at home and then just come and we'll play games. <laughs> Won't that be fun? One of the strangest phenomenons lately is to send someone a video email or a video mail. It's like a video voice. What do you call it? Granny, it's Phil. Hi, I'm Sylvie. I'm a vegetarian. Yes, and I'm gluten-free, okay? Thanksgiving. Vegetarian and gluten-free. Got it. It's on the list. Hey, Granny. It's Adam. Just a teensy little reminder that I'm lactose intolerant. You do know what that is, right? Lactose intolerant, of course. What a way to fuck up the mashed potatoes. Sure, just for you. I'll make a special bowl. Miserable, boring, mashed potatoes. Oh, and I made some brand new pals at the mall. The cutest couple ever. They were in matching hats and sweaters. Now they're coming for dinner. I don't even fucking know who they are. That'll be fun. Hey Granny, can't wait to see you. We're really excited to come to Thanksgiving, but just remember that we both don't eat meat off bones, so all the meat that we will eat will actually have to be served on a plate sliced. And I have a long list of allergies. <laughs> no meat on the bones and a long list of allergies. Sure, Granny's all over that. Fuck yeah. I wonder, do these people live in a bubble at home? It's Christine. We have nut allergies, don't forget. Can't wait. Nut allergies. Yeah. You got it. Uh, scratch pecan pie. Oh boy. Speaking of nuts, I heard from Terrence. Just a little reminder that I've gone paleo, you know? And I heard from Dominic. Oh, hi. Thanks for being like. So, I'm going to bring my, is that a special paleo diet? I'm about to lose my shit over this. <laughs> paleo. I did a lot of research on that. I looked in every cookbook, and then I went to the internet. I googled it. Hunt, fish, or find. They eat like fucking cavemen! Oh, this ought to be fun. So the hunt, fish, find, that, that scratches out Brussels sprouts. Well, I don't like them anyway. And it probably scratches out green bean casserole. And fuck yeah, that excites me, because I hate that shit. It looks and tastes like vomit. All these dietary restrictions are giving me some sort of palpitations. I just don't know how I'm going to pull this off, but you know I will. Just a moment, I'll take you into the kitchen and I'll show you. And voila, a lovely plate of organic parsley and a lovely quartered organic apple. We'll drizzle on a little extra virgin olive oil. Never had sex. Yes, and a little sea salt. Sprinkle a little sea salt. Oh, this is going to be the tits. Happy Thanksgiving. Granny loves you.